Thank you very much. It's a great honor. Thank you very much. Mr. President Zelensky, have you felt any pressure from President Trump to investigate Joe, Joe Biden and Hunter Biden? I think you read everything. So you, I think you read text. I, uh, I'm sorry, but I, I don't want to be involved to democratic, open, uh, um, elections, elections of USA. No, you heard that we had, uh, I think, good uh, phone call. It was normal. We spoke about many things, and I, so, so I think, and you read it, that nobody pushed it, pushed me. Yes. In other words, no pressure. President Trump, President Trump, President Trump, Trump, because you know what? There was no pressure. And you know there was, and by the way, you know there was no pressure. All you have to do is see it, what went on on the call. But you know that. But you could ask the question, and I appreciate the answer. Mr. Go ahead. President, 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 would you like President Zelensky to do more on Joe Biden and investigate? No, I want uh, him to do whatever he can. This was not his fault. He wasn't there. He's just been here recently. But whatever he can do in terms of corruption, because the corruption's massive. Now, when Biden's son walks away with millions of dollars from Ukraine and he knows nothing, and they're paying him millions of dollars, that's corruption. When Biden's son walks out of China with $1.5 billion in a fund, and the biggest funds in the world can't get money out of China, and he's there for one quick meeting and he flies in on Air Force Two, uh, I think that's a horrible thing. I think it's a horrible thing. I mean that we have independent country and independent general security. I can't push anyone, you know? That's it, that is the question, that is the answer. So I didn't call somebody or the new general security. I didn't ask him, I didn't push him, that's it.